you ever worked really, really hard and feel you're not like you're not getting anywhere? I was recently talking to Simon, my business partner, about a podcast he listened to about the plateau. And that is in the exercise world, and he's a professional coach to professional sports people. And he talked about how the plateau is the most important part of your training. It's that point where you level off and you're working just as hard or even harder and you're not getting any results. And it's that point in time where you make the most gains because it's your body reacting and saying to itself um oh okay i'm getting used to this i'm getting used to this pace i'm getting used to this ability and more importantly your brain is saying oh geez i never thought i could run this fast i'm going to hold it back a little bit and then i'm going to pull the trigger and go and when we talk about that with training Billy and how um, the hard days to turn up are the days that take the most effect. Oh, without a doubt, I always found the days when your training partners, even your rivals didn't turn up, they were the days when you'd find that extra edge and it won't present itself straight away. You won't feel like training probably either. You'll feel terrible, your results will be poor. Where the benefit comes is firstly in the fact you made the effort when they didn't. And secondly, it shows the, the one ingredient of all champions. And this is sporting, business, social life. Champions do things called sacrifice. They do something at a cost. They do something they don't want to do it. You talk about the plateau, the plateau to me is the false ceiling that we put on ourselves in, in life and sport. It's a false ceiling because you will go beyond it. That's why the thing called world records. That's and right. And they get broken. Yeah, that's right. And so you always personally best, do your personal best after the plateau. I throw my two favorite words in here. Yeah. Oh, we am to think about this. <laughs> Sacrifice and peeling it back as a side is layered upon layer upon layer of rubbish. Yeah. Peel it back to its rawest form. Personal accountability. Yep. That is it. You can only be honest with yourself. And so for a professional sports person, they want to plateau and then start their peak at the Olympics right at that point in time. In property deals, in any part of your life, there's points in time where you feel like you're just running along, working as hard as ever with no results. And then all of a sudden, bang, out it comes. So remember the plateau is the best part of your training.